Hey, 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 guys, this is Hawkeye, and I am back with another episode of the Hunter Classic. I am here by myself this time, but we are checking out the holiday event that's going on. I'm not going to probably be able to complete the entire holiday mission. Be nice, because you can get up to 5,000 GMS, which would be awesome, plus you get like a camouflage tree stand and apparently some other goodies, including a trophy. But you have to basically be able to take a certain size of pretty much every species on the map, then spot Rudolph <laughs> here in the Hemendal. Yes, Rudolph is here. We don't shoot, off, shoot Rudolph, though. We just try to spot him. Now, I actually shot Rudolph one year, and I've got a, him up in my lodge. I'm sure that thrilled some folks, but, you know, hey. But anyway, guys, I've got my 10-point crossbow, always as I always do. Also, I have my drill combination gun with a uh, buckshot because there is uh, there are other smaller missions to go along with this. One of which is uh, shooting a, I believe it's a fox with uh, the buckshot, the biggest fox. And I've also got my Basante pistol because there are brown bear around here. And if I spot a brown bear, the daily missions, that's something else that was newly recently added to the game. The daily mission is you get 100 GMS just for spotting a brown bear. Shooting one, I guess you don't do anything except get, maybe get a trophy. But anyway, we are going to go ahead and get started because I had one of my viewers, actually more than one of my viewers, if I'm not mistaken, ask me to do a moose mission. Well, this is moose are on the list. So we need to shoot a moose. I'm not sure how many points he has to score, but he has to score above a certain amount. I should have checked before that. Honestly, I don't remember. Uh, what I will do is I will put a list of the uh, competitions in the description of the video in the uh, bottom so that everybody kind of gets a ha you know get a better handle on it. But there's so much there, it's going to be hard to remember. And like I said, getting all of these guys is not going to be easy because some of these Species are very, very uh, skittish, you know, especially like the lynx. But I keep hearing something in the distance, and I'm going to go ahead and try and check this out. Something keeps making some kind of sound, and I can't tell what it is. It's a weird sound. It's like, or something like that. I'm not sure what that is. But anyway, it looks like there's some nice decorations they've got up going up here. I don't know if you can get anything or if it's just for looks. Uh, another thing you need to go along is uh, there's supposedly presents hidden out and about as you're going around. Looks like this is set up for Santa Claus here. Oh, I'm standing on the fire. That's always good. And toast my tootsies here. Anyway, we're going to go look for moose, I guess. Yeah, this really looks cool, guys. Yeah, I've got all my gears. Oh, one more thing. I need to put my face covering on. Let's see its face, isn't it? Uh, yeah, there it is. That'll help hide me even more. Now, I just heard that sound again. It don't know what it is. Well, let's take a look at the map here. There is a tower over here. There's one over here, and I think there's plenty of moose down here. That's kind of why I went here. I think what we're going to do, I'm going to go ahead and head over to this tower. Then I think I'm going to head on back up to this tower. I kind of like to follow the towers at first. And if we have time, I'd like to go over here. And check out this lake. I think it's going to be too hard to get over these. But here it shouldn't be quite so bad. That's a lot of walking. It doesn't look like much, but it's a lot of walking. But let me go... Oh yeah, let me go ahead and put a marker on that as well. There we go. So at least we know which way we need to go. So I was walking the entire wrong way. 
I need to descent myself. I don't need to go hot unless I absolutely have to. But since I keep hearing that weird sound, maybe that's what I'm hearing is reindeer. Bet you anything. See, one of the things about this uh, particular event, it's always 1800. So the time is always 6 p.m., which is when a lot of these guys come out right at dusk. What is that sound? That's not anything. Oh, shoot. Hold still, guys. Hold still. I'm going to go prone here. I want to get a good look at her. I think it's a female. It's hard to tell. Let me see here. No, it's a reindeer. Female reindeer. Hmm. I'll be damned. Isn't she pretty? Eh, we have to get a male, though, guys. We got another mission completed. That's more GMS. The thing about reindeer is, if there's one, there may be more. So let's just kind of hang tight here. Now there's that moose cow. Now she is headed that way. Can't believe she's by herself though. Usually they're in herds. Yeah, to get the mission completed I have to get a male and shooting her would not be that difficult. I mean, right here was perfect. I didn't have to do much of anything. My camouflage is working great. <laughs> it's always a good thing. Alright, let's go ahead and get to a crouch. I'm just kind of keeping an eye out because I'm not 100% certain she hasn't got girlfriends and maybe a boyfriend with her okay no it doesn't look like it she's still hanging out over there yes she is we are almost to this tower guys so hopefully when we get up there, we might get some perspective and be able to see something. Yeah, usually when I come out here... Oh boy. Got a moose cow. There is a present over here. I think that's what it is. Yeah, it is. Awesome. It's a purple present. It's worth five present dollars. Pretty cool. Okay, let me get up here. Yeah, I have been at this tower before. Well, guys, I tell you, I think what I'm going to do is I'm going to go do some walking. Let me see here. Okay, so I have checked down here. Walked all the way around here. I'm trying to remember where it is that Dua always went. I think he went over in this area, but he had some kind of a tent over here. So it's not going to be easy for me to get over there. 
There's also some other species over here, including lynx. I don't have anything to track them, but for the last time I was over here, I ran into a lot of reindeer. So it might be worth checking out. And I also saw a brown bear. Well, that's all we can do. Looks like I'm going to head this way. Well, we got to go kind of slow. There might not be much of anything going on. Looks like I've run into another moose, female moose. I cannot. Oh, cool. Another present. Yeah, these are worth five. Five dollars or whatever. Oh, shoot. Hello. Mm -hmm. Yeah, I don't really want to walk into her. <laughs> that would not be cool. All right, guys, looks like we got yet another present. I've only been finding the purple one, so. The fact that I've found any has been surprising. Alright guys, we are really close to a brown bear. In fact, extremely close to a brown bear. And that's kind of an important one because there's a mission if we can spot, I think it's a female. Who boy, she's close, or he's close. We also need to be careful because they are dangerous as hell. And we don't want to just surprise him. Still out far enough away. We're still far enough away if we can spot him. This is a male. And I am sorry, but I think I'm gonna have to go hot on this guy. No, not with that. I hit him. He went that away. I do need to get a, a I think a male actually has to score over 22 or something like that. Now we're going to let him get his run out. Last thing you want to do is take on a mad hurt bear. He's around in that area. Let's track using that as a guide. I definitely hit him because I saw the blood splatter on him. What's with all the poop? 
Okay, he's pretty close, so he may, may actually be down. I hit him pretty good. find his next track. Yeah, he went up. That's really kind of strange. I would have figured he'd follow, you know, going down. It'd be easier. Being hurt. There he is. I found him. Did not think a brown bear was going to be my first. Is he still alive? No, he's not. 21.850. I'm not sure if that is what I needed to get. Harvest counted for competition biggest bear starter. Well, I got that. He's a big fella. My problem is I can't seem to get him to face the right direction. <laughs> Maybe I need to switch me around and then pan this around. There we go. That's better. There we go. He was a 21. Let's see. Do I want to taxidermy him? Or sell him? So I've already got one. I think he was a better score than this one. But let me just go ahead and say... Well, I could go to the Trophy Lodge and find out. They give you some time. Eh, sell him. I think I can still taxidermy him, even though I sold him. Well, I got one of the, I think I got one of them. The requirements, I'm not sure, didn't say. It may have been 22 that I had to get better than, which is too bad. Daggone it. He was a fairly decent sized bear, I don't know why in the world you have to get such a big ass animal. <laughs> Let me see here, guys. We have something off in the distance. We have us a moose. Yes, indeed, he do. We have us a moose. So what we need to do is we need to call him in. Let's get the cells down here where we can. Use our collar. Let's put the moose juice out. Let's back up. Now, 
if we play our cards right, we can just go prone. Just let him get in real nice and close. Now let me see here. Where's my range? Now the tree is about 40 meters. So when he gets to the tree, and there he is. Let me make sure I've got my sense suppression is good. Let's just let him come in, guys. There goes another one of those willow ptarmigan. He's being kind of cautious. Now, he is not majestic, but he's not bad. Let's let him take his time. Oh, he's not bad. He's not amazing, but he's not bad. Rather, he got a little bit closer than that. He seems to be a little on the cautious side. Let me see just how far off he is. Oh, he's close enough. I hit him big time. I think he dipped his face down, so he might have gotten hit in the. F oh, he's down. He's down. Damn. That was easy. There goes the cow. Yeah, the hard part was finding him. Taking him down was easy. I must have got heart long. That's the only thing I can figure. Keep getting his roaming tracks. <laughs> well, there he is. He's not a bullwinkle, but not too bad. Not too bad. We'll see. Let's see if we can get a better position here. But he went down pretty quick. Yeah, he didn't go far at all. He is a 125. That's not too, not too bad. That's reputable. Damn. Body, shoulder blade, right lung, liver, stomach, intestine. I mean, I skewered him. <laughs> I mean, <laughs> pretty much. Alright, let's go ahead and see if we can't... Oh boy, he is not going to come up easy. Well, that's a strange looking... <laughs> uh, I kind of like it. 125. We'll accept that. And we'll sell him. Well, that gives us our moose, guys. That's our moose. 
After that, anything else is just extra. That must have been from the cow. Let me see here. Nope, those are ptarmigans. Alright guys, I am on the path of another brown bear. Ran across this fellow. Okay, there's his next track. Whoops, I didn't mean to get run. That's probably not a good idea. Wait a minute, I think I might see him. Is that him all the way across there? Yes, it is. It is a female. Well, let's keep heading this way because she's not that far off. Yep, spot a brown female brown bear completed. That's exactly what I needed to do. And that gives me 300 in-game cash for that. All I had to do is see her. All right, not bad. Yeah, I don't think I'm gonna shoot her, honestly. There's really no reason. I was really trying to complete that daily mission, but I am gonna come down here because this is one of those frozen lakes. Not all of them are frozen. Yeah, I was hoping that was a female, because that was the daily mission of the day. Every day now, there's a new daily mission, and sometimes it's just as simple as spotting an animal, or tracking an animal. You can actually hear the ice crunch. She's not very far away, but I'm just going to look over here real quick. See if I see any moose. Okay, there is something right over here. I better get into a crouch here. I don't think it's the bear. I think the bear is well gone. This sounded more like like herding animals walking. You know, like a group. You know, like, of course, like a group. Yep, I think it is. I think I might have run into some reindeer here. Oh yeah, they are. It is reindeer. They are close. Wait a minute, I think I see one. There he is. I see the bear up there too. Okay, that... She's kind of on a fast trot there. I don't know if she hears me or what the deal is, but she is... There she goes. I hit her. That time I did. <laughs> and that was on the run. 
yeah, she she jerked when I did that. There's no doubt in my mind I hit her that time. First time, maybe not. Nope, I did hit her. This must have been where I hit her. Yep. I did thought she was closer than that when I hit her. which way she went. Okay, she went this way. There she is. Two eighty three. Not sure what that is. I think that's pretty good for a female. I think the male score in the five and six hundreds. So they have a lot better antlers. But at least they score. And most of the female animals like the moose and the deer don't score. But these guys, the reindeer, they score. Okay, let's see if we can get her to a pose here. That's gonna have to do. We can sell her for more in-game money. All right, not a bad hunt. That's three species, well, three different species that we managed to get. I'm sure we need, I'm not sure if we got the scores we needed, but yeah, that's the goal. You have to get every species in this map in order to complete the Christmas mission. Then you have to spot Rudolph. You don't shoot Rudolph, you spot him. <laughs> so, anyway guys, I hope you enjoyed this episode. Please be sure to share, comment, like, and subscribe, and I will be back with another episode of the Hunter Classic. So until then, as I always say, aim straight, cast far, and have fun, and I will see you later. Bye-bye.